Okay, so I'm going to show you uh, Quadrant. This is the Galaxy S4. And I'm going to show you it's a Galaxy S4. Here's the flip cover, Galaxy S4, just to show you. I'm running a Go Launcher instead of TouchWiz. And it, this, I will let you know right now, this is a rooted device. I did root this, but there is no custom ROM or no custom recovery on it. It just has the root access. I will just show you that quickly. Here's the super user app right here. Super user. And I have um, Cedar installed. Cedar, Cedar helps reduce the lag on Android devices slightly. It offloads some memory and stuff, does recaching or some does something. I know it helps. And I'm going to show you my uh, Quadrant benchmark for this device. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to show you my settings quickly here. For developer options, I have the developer options on. Uh, my transitions are all off here, just to show you. I'm going to turn on uh, Enable 4X MSAA. It's to help the graphics. And I have the Render Force 2, 2D GPU right on top of the Enable 4X. Um, my limit background, I'm just going to put 4 for limit the background. Just to show you my developer options. We're going to go back out. All I'm going to do is clear whatever's my touch whiz, I'm going to clear the memory. This is the same thing as clearing the memory for the Samsung by holding the button. And then we're going to run Quadrant. I'm just going to turn on my Wi-Fi so I can get the Quadrant reading. And my background apps are just battery saving apps and a vast antivirus. And we're going to just run the full benchmark. That's probably I got a text, but it should have popped up. And we're going to go yes. And there we go. So I got on my device. Let me see. I got 12,623. Uh, total 12,623. Oh, sorry. Uh, CPU 4,200, no, 42,370, memory 10,283, I.O. 7,278, 2D 1,000, 3D 2,183. Thanks for watching, guys.